it's time for a couple car shows. And I got two really good ones today. Still driving the 2017 Genesis G80. It's just pretty sweet ride. Not sure exactly what the horsepower is or the cost or things like that, but I'll get into this car. This morning, I'm headed over to uh, kind of the Burbank Universal City area. There's an all Chevy show that's happening out there at some kind of all Chevy dealership. And then right after that, I'm gonna head all the way out to Thousand Oaks, which is quite a jaunt. And I'm going out there for the ADA charity car show. Anticipate lots of different kinds of cars at that show. For this vlog, we're searching for one car in particular. It's gonna be the coolest car of the vlog. May or may not agree with me when I find that car, but there's one thing we can agree on. It's gonna be cool. It's a little overcast, but no matter, it's a perfect day for a car show. Burbank, uh, almost in Glendale, where this show is. It's Community Chevrolet. It's a dealership that's right here. Looks to have some good cars. We'll see. Community Chevrolet in Burbank. This is Bill, and you have a um, well. There's a collection of Corvairs. That's correct. We have about six today, and you have two of them that uh, that I was immediately attracted to because of the colors. Right. Uh, they're amazing. But this blue one behind us, what is that? It is a 1961 700 four-door sedan, and it's actually a factory color. It's jewel blue, jewel blue number 912. And why the Corvair for you? What's what's the uh, the thing about these cars? It was a cheap car in college, and I always had an affinity for them. So I paid $100 for my first one, like three grand.
in for this, but. And how long have you had this one? This one only two years. Okay, so have you done anything to it? Uh, no, just yeah, basically just some mechanics. Exactly, yeah. what is it? and what did, what did you have, what was your first one? Uh, in 1960, a uh, green uh, four-door sedan. And you loved it that much? Yeah, yeah. 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 They were really great. That's awesome. Yeah, yeah, yeah. My buddy Jack, and uh, and we're we're you know still at this show because there's so many cool cars around. Oh, terrific including, cars! Including yours, uh, another yes. Corvair. Yes, you do. And what year is this one? Sixty-six. And what were the years that the Corvairs came out? They came, we went on sale in '59 as a '60 model. Yeah. The body style remained unchanged through '64. Okay. The body ch style changed in 65 and continued sales through 69. You guys especially love these cars. You know, they're unusual. Did you have one when you were young? No, I didn't. Okay. I, I totally paid no attention to them because I was into muscle so, cars. So what got you into this? Um, my brother uh, got one a few years ago and he was talking to me on the phone about it. I didn't know what it was. Yeah. And I was driving around and I saw one on the side of the road for sale sign. I'm 70 years old at yeah, the time. Yeah. Here's this cute little red car. So I bought it and I fell in love with it. Yeah. Yeah. And you fell in love. Yes. Yeah. Oh, like any good relationship. Oh, they're a terrific car. They're just they're a fun to drive. Yeah, yeah. Because in 60, yeah. they came out with four-wheel independent suspension. Right, right. Now, they don't have power brakes or power steering. Yeah. Okay? Well, that keeps you in shape. Well, you get to feel what you're doing. Yeah, sure. So unlike any cars since they started improving yeah. cars, yeah. they're not driver cars anymore. Yeah. yeah. And the Corvair is a driver car. Not a bad show. Some pretty good Chevys. Classics, vintage, some pretty good examples of muscle. Since the other show is all the way in Thousand Oaks, I gotta get going.
it's it's really hard to go to a car show and to pick your favorite because they're, they're just all so cool. It's like like trying to pick out your favorite candy. I mean, you probably could do it. It's really hard. Which one would, would you guys leave a comment down in the section and tell me what was your favorite for today's vlog? But before I get into what my favorite was, you know, which one stood out for me, I do want to say thank you to one particular individual. This is a, a Sarkeesian Coffee. This is a Deborah's company. Sarkeesian was started very long ago by Deborah's father, and uh, this is an incredible coffee. If you guys want to try this, this is my favorite chocolate macadamia nut. Uh, she always sends me a little bit extra. But they brew this coffee up in Big Bear uh, of all places. It's a, a uh, mountain brew coffee. Oh, the absolute best. Thank you, Deborah, for sending me a bunch of these bags. But also, a gentle reminder, just uh, like two days away, we have the Ferrari Automobili coming right there. Ferrari Automobili. Oh, this is going to be so cool. 30 Ferraris at Cafe Lux. We got an article that just came out in the Valdez Surfside News. If you uh, pick one of those up, there it is. Boom. And then, of course, on Sunday, Wheels and Waves, right here. Boom, Wheels and Waves happening. Lots of really cool cars are coming in. Even we have 12 smart cars gonna be showing up. We have a smart car club's gonna show and they're gonna take over a certain area of the parking lot. In fact, they probably will take over a very small area because the cars are kind of tiny. Hey, my favorite, my favorite. Which one stood out for me? And I always say, my favorite one is the one with four wheels. But how can you pick between the Corvairs and the muscle cars and the, 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 the what was that rat rod thing? That was, that was ridiculous. What was that thing? And then the car with the, the flag and the, the lights and all that kind of stuff. I can't pick. I like them all. It doesn't matter. I like them all. I, I, I love the fact that you guys love them. Make sure to leave a comment down in the in the comment section. You know, people that watch this vlog, they, they like hearing that, that you like their cars. You give them a little love. Leave a comment. It takes two seconds, but it makes someone's day. These shows are happening all the time out here in Southern California. I'm doing my own shows too, but my job is to bring it to you guys. And if you were curious, uh, if you were paying attention, you may have seen what I was driving. I kept on saying it was a 2017 Genesis G80. I was wrong. It's the 2018. I meant to say 2018. Just ignore the fact that I even said that. But if you were curious, 311 horsepower, 3.8 liter V6, all wrapped up in a nice little package at $56,000. This one in particular, Sibylla Red over Black. And as most luxury sedans are, it's about 20 miles per gallon. Not a big deal. Although it could be more Genesis. Could be more. Beautiful design overall. I'm digging it. But as of right now, it's gone, baby. Something else is coming up. Thanks for watching. We'll talk to you guys soon. And don't forget to hit us up on Instagram. Bam!